Bill Maher, like many of these other people, are piling on Amy Coney Barrett, who seems very nice. I don't have any complaints. Yeah, it seems very nice. Yeah, what the hell? Like, yeah, okay, she, she seems very nice. Is that what you, how you judge? Bill Maher, like many of these other people, are piling on Amy Coney Barrett, who seems very nice. I don't have any complaints about her. I know a lot of people who are Catholic. Seems very nice. Yeah, there are a lot of people with some really, really, really dangerous ideas that seem very nice. Is that... That's... That is not relevant. They seem very nice. Is that really... You're putting... You're putting an insane person at the highest position in the judicial system in the United States and they have extremely nutty ideas and your comment on that is like, ah, oh, she seems very nice. Okay. Not a very good way to evaluate. Torello is saying, it seems that the world does not have enough uh, producers of lube given the number of butthurt people. Yeah, exactly. Good point there. What, 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 what are we supposed to do? Are we supposed to in insult? Look how, look how... God damn hypocrisy on this show is outrageous! Oh my god, this guy is gonna explode. What, what, what are we supposed to do? Are we supposed to in insult these people? Tell them they're all stupid? We could tell them some of their ideas are stupid. Why not? Why not? What's wrong with that? If you have stupid ideas, be prepared to be called out for your stupid ideas. Not work with them, not be friends with them, not buy from them? Who said that? No, we could. Call, is, who said that? Who said that? What? Look at this. You're just making stuff up. Temple is, you know, Temple just is, is such a straw man. He just makes stuff up. He's an idiot. Temple, you see, you're a moron. Okay. Who said that? Like he said, we said Amy Con Coney Barrett has nutty ideas. Okay. She has nutty ideas. She's a moron. Okay. And now saying like, does that mean we shouldn't be friends with them? Not buy for them? Who said that? Who said that? If we call out religious ideas as moronic, when did when did Bill Maher or any of us suggest that we shouldn't buy stuff from religious people or be friends with religious people? I'm sure uh, almost everybody has moronic ideas, and they need to be called out. When did you you your entire channel is dedicated to what you consider moronic? To highlighting things that you consider being moronic. Does that mean that you're suggesting that we shouldn't be buying stuff from these people? Is that what you're saying? Look at the hypocrisy here. Your videos, Tim, Tim Pool, are the entire point of your channel is to like, oh, fi find out left, left leaning lunacy and highlighting it as moronic. That's what you do. And now when other people do that with religious views, and you're like, oh, what are you supposed to do? What are you supposed to Yeah, call them out. That's what you do. Like, what does, does that mean we shouldn't be friends with them and not buy stuff from them? Who said that? That's the only way you, you, your channel is getting so much. Like, that's how you're growing, because you just do straw mans of other people. And you're idiot. You're people, people as stupid as this guy. What is this? Who's this guy? The guy that is buttered. Yeah. Mississippi Pitbull. People who are this stupid that just are so biased, they just eat it up because they, they can't see what you're doing because you straw man everything you don't like and you make it so easy to attack people. You're like, who said that? Look at this. Are we supposed to in insult these people? Tell them they're all stupid? No, we, need to, we don't tell them they're all stupid about everything. We just tell them that these ideas that they have is moronic. That's what we do. That's what we do. Um, and yeah, and that's what you do. Not work with them. Not, not work with them. Be no. friends with them. Not, not be friends with them. Nobody said that. Not buy from them. Not buy from them. Nobody said that. What the hell are you talking about? That's insane. There, there are a large portion of people in this country, the majority actually, who are Christian, a large portion who are Catholic. Yeah, and, they, and they're all wrong about their religion. They all have, they all have moronic views. You, if you're, if you believe in Christianity, I'm sorry, you have moronic views. You, you have, you have nutty beliefs. Sorry, I don't care that you're a majority. It's just true. Okay, are you, are you a moron about everything? Probably not. 
are you all the same level of moron because you're Catholics? No. The more you take ca the Catholic religion seriously, the more moronic your views are. So it's not just a binary thing. Again, the exact difference between Biden and Amy Coney uh, Barrett. And we live together. We work together. Well, here's what Bill... Yeah, we work together. We live together and we work together and we call each other out when we have moronic views. That doesn't contradict each other. Well said. Commentator Bill Maher has drawn a backlash after calling Supreme Court nominee Amy Coney Barrett nuts. No, tr turtleneck, to summarize, everyone is stupid. No, just because you have stupid beliefs, that doesn't mean you're fully stupid, okay? If, again, not, you know, everybody has stupid beliefs. I guess, like, you could call somebody completely stupid if most of their beliefs are stupid. But just because you have some stupid beliefs, that doesn't mean you're, you're stupid. That's not how I define somebody as stupid. Because if, if, you, if that's how you define somebody as stupid, then, then everybody is stupid. I think, like, you have to have almost everything you believe in has to be stupid for me to label you as a, as a stupid person. Which is, again, not, 